went from California, from Iowa, and Asian Americans traveled from local Cincinnati communities to support 61-year-old Sherry Chen. I'm really, really grateful. Even Chinese media gathered outside of the federal building downtown this afternoon for a case that has made national and international headlines. Two years ago, federal agents arrested Chen and accused her of being a Chinese spy. She was accused of using a stolen password to download information about American dams and lying about meeting with a high-ranking Chinese official. The scientist then lost her job at the National Weather Service in Wilmington. My life is turned upside down, not once, but twice. So I really, you know, lost everything. A week before Chen was scheduled to go on trial in federal court, federal prosecutors abruptly dropped all charges against the Wilmington resident. No explanation was given, Chen says. For two years, her life's been turned upside down in legal defense. Today, legal proceedings continue inside federal court as Chen fights the government for wrongful termination and racial discrimination. It is wrong. Uh, Sherry Chen is a lawyer, American citizens for 20 years. She was educated in U.S. and she's an American just like us. We are all immigrants. Today can happen to Sherry Chen, tomorrow can happen to me. Ultimately, Chen says she wants her job back. And the hearing in federal court will resume tomorrow. Defense attorneys say they are putting on evidence that will hopefully get Chen her job back. Reporting live downtown, Karen Johnson, WLWT News 5.